so he's been on the opposite side of it. They've got time to groom, and Andy Dalton's the perfect guy to do it. Fields with a completion. He's able to find Demir Bird, the new addition. Fields out on the perimeter. We're dealing with Justin Fields, so going in the wrong, wrong direction right now. Fields rolling right. Firing across his body, and he's got Damian Williams, so they'll get that cushion yardage back. Check down. Oh, it was deflected and runs down incomplete. Christian Wilkins was there to knock that ball away. It's very good decision maker for what I've seen. Biggest transition for him is really going to be calling plays. A lot of it came from the sideline last year at Ohio State. Trying to rope that into Chris Lacey and Nick Needham with the knockaway. Third down and a picture of that play in his mind. And he even talked about it. And Matt Nagy talked to us about it last night. That he's starting to see that picture. He's getting better at calling the plays. And he's been practicing because he's willing to work at it. And he's got a great mentor in Andy Dalton that's helping him and giving him the ropes of how to do it. Spoke very highly of the two days that they were at joint practice together. And that one's going to get rescued quickly by Khalil Herbert. It'll be second down coming up. I think you're right. It's going to be more in vogue. Teams, some teams have done it with two cross uh, scrimmages with teams. So it's going to be more and more around the NFL. That one nearly intercepted as Fields lofted it. It was deflected by Clayton Fedulum. Four years as a Pittsburgh Steeler. Comes with a lot of catches there. Yes. Over 40 receptions pretty much every year. Last year as a Detroit Lion. Justin Fields fumbled the football. It is loose on the sideline. Fields was racing back to try to rescue it. Nick Needham made the stop on field. Tuck it away. They're going to swipe at it. Headed away from his body right there. Just have to be aware. There's Khalil Herbert in. Fields plants and fires, and he's got Lacey to the 30-yard line. Not going to put Tua Tunga Viola in there until he was ready. Fields checked down again. Herbert has the first down. Fields showing off the arm strength, looking up the sideline for Javon Wims. Second down coming up. Given from Day to Nagy about Nagy's rookie quarterback. Another check down to Herbert. This time he's able to force himself out of bounds. Third down and five. Given Fields a chance to throw it again. Across his body and he connects. He's got Justin Hardy. Seven seconds left. Fields has to be ready on this snap from the 43. Slings it out sideline. He connects with Jesse James. And obviously would just dazzled in that game against Clemson. Wow. You know, again, displayed his toughness, the six touchdowns. I mean, this guy is a, really a physical, physical quarterback. Across his body, on the move, Riley Ridley, a guy that he's familiar with from their days at Georgia together before Fields went to Ohio State. First and 15. Fields arching it up there. What a grab by Rodney Adams. Beautiful touch, beautiful catch. First down. He was third in air yards. So he really tested the limits of defenses downfield. He'll check it down for Herbert here, and he immediately gets wrapped up by Duke Riley, and then finished off by the rest of the Dolphin D. Fields gets away from the initial pressure. Little fake, little shimmy, and a lob up to Rodney Adams again. Fields rolling. He'll take off, pick up a couple. Second and goal. They did get a lot of single high safety down there, and then it's one-on-one -on -one with the receivers. That's a good set of receivers down there. And he ran for 15 touchdowns. Flag is thrown. Fields avoiding the pressure. Just Take like it off. Right, here. right on cue. Justin Fields to the end zone. We'll check the flag. Look at the poise, though. He's sitting there. He's looking. He's processing. Steps up. Feels it. Now he's trying to get guys to clear out for him. He knew he was going to take off with it right then and there. A lot of football knowledge at the quarterback position. Justin Fields has done well in his last two drives. Has Rodney Adams diving for a grab. 
And it's incomplete. On third and six. Nice read. He finds Adams. And a good defensive play by Igbenogany to stop Rodney Adams from the line to gain. But Igbenogany may have taken the worst of that. Front, Elijah Wilkinson as well. The Dieter, he's done a lot of weightlifting. Very strong player at the guard spot. Fields using the legs once more. Look how fast he is. First down. He can accelerate fast. See, this never had that problem. <laughs> but he can accelerate. You see right there, this look, it's so easy for him. Just accelerates. Look at the strides. Adam Redmond is at center right now doing the snapping. Here's the boot again. And Redmond is there to block. Throwback. Fields has Jesse James. Back pedals in. Fields with a touchdown. And the Bears take the lead. Nice play. A little chilly roll. So they got to respect the run. Throwback. To Jesse James. Good fake. Shows the ball. They buy it. Look at all the defenders going with the run game. And then Jesse James sneaks out. Gets lost in coverage. Backpedals into the end zone. Command of the huddle yeah. is, is such a big part of it because you're, you're selling the play or giving tidbits of information to players of what you're expecting on a play. Martavis Pierce got rocked on the outside by Perry. Jamal Perry in his third year out of Iowa State.